When Travis and I got married, he had always said from day one that he wanted to live in Auburn because he loved Auburn so much. And, and he knew it would be an awesome place to raise our kids when we had kids. So in 2000, he told me we were moving back to Auburn and starting a business. So here we go <laughs> with, with four kids. <laughs> and um, so that, that's, that's why we moved back to Auburn and that was his dream, it was his goal. His passion was Auburn, always has been. The T.O. Raven Golf Tournament, what it means to me, it just shows the impact that my dad has left on this community, that it's been going on for 12 years now and will continue to go on as long as these people just keep showing up. The reason they do show up is my dad just shared love with so people so, so well, was a fearless leader and a godly man. So it just shows the impact that he has left on people. It inspires me, you know, to be a better man each and every day and to work hard and never quit. So that's what this tournament means to me. My dad invested a lot in this community and I think it still shows today how passionate he was about this community and all the people that um, he spent time with and left a mark on. It's kind of ironic that this day is a golf tournament because my dad was never a golfer. Um, you could never find him on a golf course. It most likely would have been an intramural football league or game, but that doesn't raise a lot of money. So this is just a fun day for everybody and you know all of his fraternity brothers come out and play. So it's just really fun that it's a game of golf and I'm sure he thinks it's funny too. So what this foundation means to me is family. My dad loved family and basically the sole purpose of this foundation is to raise money for organizations but ultimately we take these organizations and they become our family. One of my dad's quotes that he lived by was only your best will do. I don't think we should ever stop this foundation. I don't think we should stop working harder to make this foundation known because we need to reach the best. My prayer for this foundation comes from Ephesians 2.10 and that's that the Lord can do more than we can ever ask, hope, or imagine. And I pray that every single day for this foundation. One of the events this year that the foundation helped support was Come Together Oxford, which is a community-wide worship event for the entire Oxford community and Ole Miss students. We were fortunate enough to be able to bring in Passion Music and Louis Giglio. It's just really special seeing how it doesn't just stop in Auburn and how the foundation is looking to other communities and how they can help other communities as well. I want to talk to you a little bit about the history of the Travis Rayburn Foundation. and. Uh, my brother passed away in January of 2008 and through relationships he had with some great friends and, and um, they just were inspired uh, with their relationship by Travis to do something and um, they just kept talking to me the months after Travis had passed away and, and um, just wanted to really try to build a legacy upon what Travis had already done in his life. So, Born out of that conversation and that conviction and passion and love for my brother became a golf tournament. And uh, initially was a group of friends uh, that had known Travis for 20 something years. We got together and just through more conversation, we decided to um, uh, build a field house in Travis's honor at his high school at, at Auburn. And uh, we took the endeavor on as the business and created the foundation. The money started coming in and, and uh, that's how it got started. And uh, a better way to put it, Travis started it. It was his life and, and his passions and his uh, walk with his faith and his friendships and the relationships that, that, that he developed started this. So today we're here because Travis is not here. And uh, his work continues in this community and he loved Auburn so the foundation, uh, the board uh, meets and, and we, um, we plow back those resources into the community that Travis loved. Here we are 11 years uh, later in our 11th annual tournament and um, we stand very humble and, and um, uh, continue to work to uh, keep that going forward.